Welcome back, Griswold School! Boys and girls, Mrs. Quinn and I are so excited to welcome you back to school. Whether you're joining us remotely or in person, we can't wait to get the school year started because we are better together. In this video, you'll see your Griswold teachers walking you through the different ways that we intend to keep you safe here at school. You'll also get a sneak peek at our different outdoor learning spaces where you'll be able to learn and play with your classmates. School may look different this year, but what hasn't changed is our love and care for you and how excited we are to welcome you back. Our drop-off procedure has changed. If you get dropped off in the loop, you will now walk towards the Playscape and enter through the Playscape doors. Follow the white dots and signs. Teachers will be there to help. Welcome boys and girls. This year at school, you will wear a mask that looks like this. You will wear the mask to stay safe. You will put the mask on like this. You cover your nose and make sure it covers your mouth and the straps go around your ears. Then you can adjust it to make it feel comfortable to your face. Boys and girls, some teachers may be wearing a face shield like this. This year, you will wear your mask like a superhero wears their cape. See you soon. Hand washing is another way we can stop the spread of germs. We should wash our hands before and after we eat, after we blow our nose, after we use the bathroom, and after we cough or sneeze. When hand washing is not available, we can use hand sanitizer. Make sure to rub the sanitizer all over your hands and wait for it to dry. At school, we will practice social distancing. Social distancing is one way to prevent germs from spreading from person to person. Social distancing means we stay six feet apart from each other. That's about two arm lengths apart. In our classrooms, your teacher might be sitting behind a plastic shield. You will also have a plastic shield on your desk. At school, we will have our own workspace and materials. We will not share materials for now. We will keep our workspace and materials clean. Boys and girls, when you return to school, you'll be so happy to know that we're going to be spending so much time outside. One thing you'll need to bring to school with you is a beach towel. Bring it to school with you on Monday. You can store it in your duffel bag. And when your teacher wants to bring you outside for outdoor learning, or snack, or lunch, or morning meeting, you can use your towel to sit on. At the end of the week, you'll bring it home to be washed, and then bring it back to school the following week. We know how excited you are to see our friends and your teachers, and we can't wait to say hello to you either. Just remember that we do have to keep things safe. So here's some ways that you can say hello while also practicing social distancing. For instance, you can use a hair hug or you could use thumbs up. You can also just do a simple wave or an air high five. Or you can do an air fist bump or give someone a heart. So we know that there's lots of different ways that you can do a socially distanced greeting. We challenge you to come up and bring a new one when you come back to school on the first day. So let's recap some of the most important things, the three W's. Wash your hands, wear a mask, and watch your distance. We know things are gonna look very different this year and you'll probably have questions, so please ask your teachers, we're here to help. We can't wait to see you, we really miss you. Remember, we are Griswold Eagles and we always soar, which means we're, we're always better together. together.